Again, taking the advantage when they've had this great, as you mentioned, Taz, trio match. And look what? at Dark Order. They're doing all oh, oh, my God. God. the screwdriver. Oh, to the head of Hangman and Page. Dark Order. What up, y'all? This is your boy Ace here. And welcome to Afternoon's Delight. Let's start out with Dynamite tonight, man. I want to start out with this... Uh, what has been announced is going to be the Blood and Guts match um, on July 19th from Boston, Massachusetts from the TD Garden. This is the AEW's first show from the TD Garden. They've been in Boston before, but they did it at the uh, smaller, uh, what they call it, what's that arena called? Uh, a Gannon Center, I think. Is that the one? Oh, is that the one in Philly? Uh, but anyways, they're, they're going to do it at TD Garden. That's the home of the Celtics and Bruins. They're going to be here on July 19th, and it's going to be Blood and Guts. So this segment was really interesting because obviously we had the elite uh, Hangman Page with uh, the Young Bucks. They defeated John Silver, Alice Reynolds, and uh, Evil Uno in a uh, trios match, right? So after the match ended, we quickly saw, I think it was Ca uh, Claudio Casanoli came in first with the chair and the whole Blackpool Combat Club members, uh, Moxley, Casanoli, Willie Yuta, and then along with... Uh, Konosuke uh, Takeshka also came out. Uh, they entered. Uh, they entered the ring and started to beat up on everybody who was trying to either, either everybody that was in the elite or everybody trying to defend the young bus. Now, what was interesting though was that okay, so Moxley at one point he had a screwdriver and he used it on uh, uh, Page, right? So this is another screwdriver spot, and um, it made uh, Hangman bleed pretty good. So he bled from the forehead, and uh, a lot of the ring was getting covered in blood. And what was interesting here was, so the Dark Order been, you know, they've been talking about how Hangman been leaving him hanging, and how they don't think that he's been valuing the friendship that he had with him in the pay in the past because he's been hanging back out with the Young Bucks and Kenny and stuff like that, Omega. And so they didn't help him. They walked away from the ring as he was looking at him as he was bleeding. So this is going to, I'm liking that they're kind of continuing that it didn't act like, because you know how sometimes wrestling companies just try to act like something happened that, you know, like they're going to try to act like Hangman wasn't friends with Eva, uh, I mean, uh, Dark Order before, right? I'm glad that they're continuing that and they're letting the fans know, like at one point, Paige was really tight with the Dark Order. And um, so I'm liking how they le left that in there. And so basically they just announced that, you know, that they're going to have blood and guts and all that stuff. So. I did like I, I liked it. I, I like this whole segment right here. Eddie Kingston also got the beast as well. He was up in there trying to defend the elite, uh, even though he claims he doesn't like him. I think what's going to end up happening is they're just going to have his partnership with Eddie Kingston because it's all the same thing. Eddie Kingston wants a piece of Mox. He wants uh, Castanoli, so they all got something in common. So they, you know, that that's going to be the thing. So I'm wondering. If that's the blood and guts match, because we know Brian Danielson, he's out with his injury, so he's not going to be one of the Blackpool Combat members that's probably going to be in this uh, match. I think it's going to be another five on five in this blood and guts match. So we're going to see who all the members is. I think Eddie's going to be with the Elite, and we got to figure out who the other members are going to be, because I think uh, Blackpool Combat Club they're going to have their four, but uh, Takeshka also helping them. So we got to figure out the other members who are going to be involved. So it's going to be very interesting. Let me let me get y'all thoughts on this, man. I can't wait for this match now. I'm glad that this is the Blood and Guts match. Because I expected it to be the Blood and Guts match. I was saying, you know, who are the Blood and Guts match? I said the Elite and Blackpool Combat Club. That's got to be the Blood and Guts match. Because I knew Blood and Guts was coming up pretty soon. It's usually always this time of year in the summertime. So um, now we got a date on it and, and we got a location on where it's going to be. But let me know y'all thoughts on it. Go ahead and give this video a like, share, subscribe. Y'all thank y'all for watching. After do's delight.